Welcome to the Aircraft Spruce Quick Review. I'm Ryan Deck, Avionics Sales Manager, and this video we'll be looking at the Garmin GTR255COM and GNC255 NAVCOM series radios. Garmin has released the TSO GTR and GNC radio series to replace the SL40 and SL30 product line, offering a larger screen format and new features for use in the general aviation market. Here are three key features of the GTR and GNC radio series. The differences between the units are simple, as the 225 COM does not have nav abilities and has three buttons for COM return, COM memory, and intercom adjustment, where the 255 nav COM adds a nav volume control knob and three buttons for COM nav flip-flop, OBS tuning with graphical CDI, and two from button to toggle between the active VOR. On the left side of the display, there are COM and NAV knobs which allow you to adjust the volume by rotating them. By pressing the COM knob, you can manually override the auto squelch, as shown by a SQ indication, and by pressing the NAV button, a Morse code tone will be heard, as shown by an ID indication. This leads us to our first key feature, which is the ability to monitor the standby frequency, and by pressing the MON button, you will begin to monitor the standby, as shown by the changing from the STB to MN indication next to the standby frequency. Frequencies can be changed by using the outer and inner knob on the right side of the display. Above this is the flip-flop button, as shown with the dual arrows allowing you to change your standby to your active frequency and by pressing and holding the flip-flop button for 3 seconds, the emergency 1 to 1.5 frequency will automatically be put into the active position. Both units have the function button, which adds new features allowing you to view COM and NAV frequency lists, and adjust intercom, system, and timer configurations. Which leads us to our second key feature, and that is the addition of the 8.33 kHz spacing, meeting the European requirement and by going to the system configuration, you can adjust the COM spacing based on your needs. The last key feature is the built-in frequency database, allowing you to access the COM or NAV database right from the unit. This will allow you to enter a three-letter identifier of an airport or NAV aid into the unit and pull up the different frequencies that are available, and by pressing the flip-flop or enter button, you can put that desired frequency into your active or standby position. The database can be updated via the USB port on the top right of the display with the use of a USB memory stick. Also, when connected to an external GPS source, you can quickly pull up nearest frequencies, such as airport, center, or VOR. The GTR and GNC come in different versions with or without 8.33 spacing and with 10 or 16 watt transmit power configurations and also include a built-in cooling fan. For complete product information on the Garmin 225 or 255 series radio, please visit our website at www.aircraftspruce.com or call us at 1-877-4-SPRUCE.